This is Lee from the Inquirer and I'm with Ford at its Research and Development Centre in Cologne, Germany, where 3D printing technology plays a role in the design and process of its vehicles. Um, can you explain what's going on here and how 3D printing is employed in Ford? Yeah, within Ford we are using different uh, technology and one technology is 3D printing. Um, you see the machine and the part. Um, this is used mainly in the development process for design and development and evaluation processes. Uh, you can get parts very quickly based on 3D uh, CAD data sets um, which can then be used for testing or uh, um, as space uh, for discussion um, where physical parts. Uh, here you see the 3D printing part. The big advantage here is, especially with this technology, that you can apply different materials in one go. Um, you see in the middle, this is a hard material, and here at uh, the corner, this is a soft material. You can tune this uh, rubber kind of material. This is every time a discussion with the engineer. You can, if you like, apply some graining so that you have uh, a design how the part will look like in, uh, in the future. And how uh, are there different materials? How, how are they used within the, uh, the building of, of this process? This depends really on the demand which uh, is required. This is an um, uh, active discussion we have with the engineer uh, and based on this discussion we are saying okay we can apply or we can offer you this material, this material and uh, yeah, uh, based on, on this uh, discussion of the result we are then starting the machine to produce a part. Cool. And what uh, main advantages does 3D printing bring to the work here at Ford? The big advantage is that you have, in a very early stage, physical parts which uh, can be used for testing and uh, support the development process. So you can produce parts, you can evaluate, and when you think you are done with your design, the design is feasible, um, it's doing what uh, the design is for, you can then, very confident, give the kickoff uh, for the tooling. Um, which ensures that we do not have any tooling change which are expensive and time consuming at the end and bring a certain impact to the complete um, development and production chain. Cool. And um, could you ever see if 3D printing replace um, all technologies in vehicle production in the future? Um, at the moment, uh, my personal opinion is, is no. But uh, the technology is making big step forwards so that uh, at least a certain part could be replaced, but uh, to replace uh, complete conventional uh, processes, um, that's uh, not possible. Cool. Thank you very much. Thank you.